Hi, my name's Andy Edwards and I want to tell you why I play Dream Symbols. Um, a few years ago I was doing a gig and a friend of mine said, why don't you try these cymbals out? So I took them along and played them and I saw, thought they sounded amazing. Um, so I went to the uh, Dream website to see how much they cost. I thought, of course, they were some sort of custom-made cymbals that cost a ton of money. Uh, when I got there I saw the prices and I was even more amazed. So straight away um, I... Uh, rang up at Dreams that I wanted to play your cymbals and I moved from my old cymbal company to Dream Cymbals. Uh, since then I've used them in a variety of settings live and in the studio and I've used these especially for a lot of studio work. Every time I've gone in I've been complimented by the sound of these cymbals. And in a couple of cases the producer in there said I'm going to get a set of these. Um, why are they so good? Well they don't have those ugly overtones that you get in certain symbols. Um, I found in all sorts of settings they they uh, they always sound great. Um, I found that with the with the drums um, that um, you can change the drum heads on a drum kit and you can tune them, and so you can really change the sound of a drum kit, but you can't change the sound of the symbols. Symbols are really really important. So what I always look for is a symbol that is going to work in all sorts of different situations and in all sorts of different playing situations. Um, I've found that these cymbals can be used in a variety of ways. So you get a great sound out of the bell, you get a great sound on the edge. Um, the, a lot of the crash cymbals I use is, as ride cymbals and a lot of the ride cymbals I use as crash cymbals because they don't have those big clunky overtones when you hit it wrong. You may not have heard of the brand before. Um, if you haven't and you're thinking of buying a cymbal, then please go and check these out right now. If you want to hear what they sound like, I played them on an album called The 27 Club by a progressive rock band called Magenta. Mm -hmm.